Hey everyone, today I'm going to take you on my uh, daily walk that I go on and we're going to look at what we can see, what we can hear, what we can smell and then maybe you can do the same on your daily walk or even go into your gardens and have a little look. When you're on your walk, make sure you don't touch your face or rub your eyes with your hands and when you get home, the first thing you do is to wash your hands with plenty of soap. Stay safe and look forward to seeing what you got up to. Hi, so currently I'm in a nature reserve, um, so I'm just listening to what I can hear, um, looking at the trees, looking at the plants around, um, seeing if I can spot any wildlife. Um, so far I've seen a squirrel, a blue tit and a magpie. Um, but yeah, when I actually stand still, I can hear lots of different birds, so there's definitely more around here somewhere. We're in a nature reserve, and as you can see, I'm actually following a magpie. When you're on your daily walk or in your garden, just stand still for a little bit, um, see what you can hear, um, see what you can see. Can you see birds? Can you hear birds? Can you see butterflies? Can you see any other wildlife? So now I've come to the river. Um, so this is where we look at whether there's different types of wildlife um, compared to at the nature reserve. Um, so what birds have we got on the river compared to what we saw more in the trees? Um, do we see more butterflies around here? Or do we see more butterflies in the nature reserve? Um, so yeah, let's find out. A minute and have a listen. We can see another swan. We can also hear lots of seagulls and the bells in the boats. Get while you are out. Um, see what smells you can smell. So can you smell the sea air? Can you smell cut grass? Can you smell someone cooking a barbecue? Just gonna stand here for a minute to see what else we can hear. See if we can spot any birds anywhere. So on my walk today I've seen a peacock butterfly, a holly blue butterfly and an orange tip butterfly. Um, so what I do is I'll upload an identification sheet so you can see what you can find on your walk. while you're on your walk is to get a piece of paper and stick double sided cellar tape to it and then when you're walking around you collect bits of nature so you collect some leaves or you collect some petals or some blossom things that you find on the floor don't pick anything off the trees or bushes um, and see if you can make a rainbow picture out of nature right, I'm coming to the last bit of the walk now um, so I'm very lucky that within an hour's walk, I can do both, both nature reserves um, and I can do the river. Um, so yeah, this is just the last nature reserve coming back the opposite way to the way we came. See what birds we can see darting between the bushes. So 
days today though so make sure you do try and get some fresh air whether it's in your garden or on a daily walk um, and then yeah when you get back let us know what you see or what you hear <laughs>